Sorry if the lighting is off. I feel like things are off. Whatever. My eyes might just be fooling me. Anyways, um, we need to stop having 30 second unskippable ads. Specifically, the anti vape ones. Now, I like the message, you know? Don't vape. Because it's cringe, you know? Not only is it cringe, you can hurt your lungs and all of that. And a lot of young people do it. And even older, you know, whatever. And um, obviously there's warning labels, but uh, it's just dumb. But ads are targeted at you by YouTube. And by other, you know, companies and stuff. But usually, you know, when other companies like target me, that is like, oh, whatever, you know. They actually make sense. Why am I getting targeted for anti-vape ads? I don't know. Do I watch YouTubers that, like, vape or something? No. Um, have I ever vaped? No. Will I ever vape? No. What is going on? I don't know. But this has been happening for, I'd probably say, about six months now. And I just want to run down maybe the, um, like, top five ones that I've seen. It's really the only five I've seen um, from, like, least prevalent to most prevalent. Let's start out with just, here's the truth, you know, stand up for yourself, text this to stop juuling. You know, that one's not too bad, I get it. Text to stop juuling, that's the truth, you know. Okay, kinda cool. And then, we have the pimple pop one. Um, the pimple pop one is kinda weird, and again, if you haven't seen these ads, you're probably not gonna understand, but it's like, imagine if, you know, you're popping a pimple or whatever, and then it's kinda, you know, kinda gross, you know, whatever, and I, I think that might work, you know, it's kinda gross out. And then we have, um, like, one can of dip can, like, cause, um, cause me to end my, uh, career in this and that and the other. And that's all cool. And I think that that either will work or not work. But, you know, that's kind of a 50-50. And then, um, crap, what's that second one? Second and last one. Um... Ooh, yeah, and then there's the one where it's like, um, you have to, like, get your tongue removed or something, and then it, like, lists all the effects, like, that can happen. Um, I think that's good, but I also think that they know that, and plus, that's, like, the second most repetitive. And number one, and here is the worst ad I've ever seen. I freaking hate it. Stop targeting me with this ad. Um, I bet you the most recent I saw it was, like, freaking two days ago. Either way, I've been seeing it consistently. Is to show you how harmful Julian and vaping is, we showed you metal monsters. To, to get toxic metals into your body. And then it's like this metal monster thing. And it always happens when I'm listening to music. And it's an unskippable ad. And it, it, and it's like 30 seconds. And then one time I got like the extra long one. And I didn't know it was coming. And then it gets behind the scenes. I Why is there a behind the scenes to an anti-vape ad? Here's behind the scenes of how we're trying to get you to stop vaping. Dude, go back to the number five and four that I said. Because... But also don't repeat them as much, okay? Because I really do think that if someone is vaping or joining, are they really going to listen to these ads and, like, stop? Um, well, most likely not because, you know, you're going to have to want to stop no matter what, even if it is convincing. Um, and also do what those good, good, good anti-cigarette ads do where, it, like, shows like the I better smoke them for 50, you know, kind of scare tactics and all that. That's why I kind of like um, the pimple pop gross out kind of thing. And, um, yeah, I... There are tactical ways to do it, but just stop targeting me, please. It gets annoying. It's getting on my nerves. So that's kind of my my PSA to these PSAs, you know. Uh, please stop showing me these ads. They're getting very annoying. Thank you. Have a good day. And when I see you again, I will be ending the video like this. Tomorrow is Wednesday. Rundown. Yo, yo, I'm out.